In the past, we've taken a look at the Illegal Apex 24 and 27, great gaming monitors at their respective price range. Today in the studio, we have the Apex 25 and despite its smaller size compared to the 27, it's got a few extra tricks up its sleeve. Let's check it out. The Illegal Apex 25 is a 24.5 inch Full HD IPS display in a 16 by 9 aspect ratio with a maximum refresh rate of 240Hz and a 1 millisecond response time. The monitor also supports adaptive sync and HDR making images look sharp and vibrant. Although I must say that Illegal did not mention which version of HDR is supported. Let's move to the back of the monitor. In terms of I.O., you'll find two HDMI 1.4 one DisplayPort 1.2, one headphone jack and the power input. Besides that, you also have a single light bar, VESA mount and built-in speakers. These are a nice to have but don't expect excellent audio quality. It gets the job done for media consumption and some casual gaming. Here's a sample. The menu system can be accessed by using the navigation buttons that are located at the front of the display. It's got all the necessary settings for image, power and performance. Now let's look at the stand. It's unfortunately not adjustable and for some taller people like me, it means that the display will be nowhere near eye level. This is where the Illegal Ruka monitor arm comes into the picture. I know, I know, this is like they're selling the problem and the solution separately, but in order to keep the monitor cost down, some sacrifices need to be done and more often than not, it'll be the monitor stand. Now back to the Ruka, it comes in either a single or dual monitor support. I actually really like the grey and white finish of the monitor arm. It's a refreshing look compared to the common black coloured ones. With the Ruka, you unlock a wide range of viewing possibilities. Besides height adjustment, you can also tilt, swivel and rotate the display to your exact needs. I love using monitor arms because they clear a ton of space off your desk. Cables will also not be a mess because the Ruka has built-in cable management. The last thing worth mentioning is that the Ruka supports display sizes from 17 inches up to 32 inches. Now let's get back to the monitor. I spent the last few days mainly playing Valorant on this display and I must say that the 240Hz refresh rate is amazing. My current monitor is 144Hz and I thought it was good enough, but having tried 240Hz, I might need to reconsider that thought. To put this into perspective, a 120Hz display will show 120 images a second and a 240Hz display will show 240 images a second. This results in a smoother and more accurate gaming experience. Now despite being heavily focused as a gaming monitor, watching videos on the Apex 25 was not bad either. With the HDR support, colors pop out and the image is plenty sharp at 1080p on the 24.5 inch display. So let's wrap things up. If you're new to gaming or looking to upgrade to your first gaming monitor, the Apex 25 at around 800 ringgit is a great deal. In fact, I don't think there's many options for a 240Hz display at that price point. The Ruka on the other hand costs 133 ringgit for the single monitor support and 190 ringgit for the dual monitor support. It goes extremely well with the Apex 25 and like I said, I really like the look of it. So that's it for this video. As usual, all the purchase links will be in the description box below. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys for the next one. Bye!